one. Are you ready to go work on daddy's car? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> okay, let's go. It's so hot out, but we're working on the E36 vert. We got it jacked up right now. I have my coilovers from the race car that came with the car that I took off, put BCs on. I haven't showed you guys that car yet, but I'll show you in the next video. We're gonna throw them on here. If you guys also didn't see, I got a super fresh set of Style Fives, um, in extremely good condition, no caps, but I'll figure that out. So let's get this stuff out of the trunk and put it on the car. I'm already out of breath, it's so freaking hot. All right, boys, I didn't wanna bore you with a coilover install. I'm not an install YouTuber kind of guy, but we got, boom, boom. These are the coilovers that were off the uh, drift car. Just threw them on here, bolted everything in. Just did one side. I got that side, that's the stock one, so I gotta do that, and the rears. The person who freaking did this before me, they must have like blown the shocks and changed the shocks. Hold oh, my camera off nasty. There we go. Must have blown the shocks and changed them because the two bolts that go back here, uh, these ones, red lock tight. The whole thing. It literally took me 20 minutes just to get these two bolts off. But we busted out the impact and we got them off. So let's finish the other side. All right, boys. It's the next day. It was way too hot yesterday. So we starting again today. This is the fitment on the front. It is sitting pretty good spot, I think. Oh no, I think the paint is chipping a little bit right here. That's not good. Uh-oh. Anyways, I won't, I won't think about it. I'm gonna go a little bit lower, I think, because this side, don't mind how dirty the car is. This side sits a little closer. I might try to do that. This side might not. But then again, with me sitting in the car, I should bring it down a little bit, so. We'll just leave that, but time to do the rear. I'm gonna try to do like fender to lip on the rear so it's just a little bit lower. We're gonna throw these on. I'm not gonna bore you with the install. I'm just gonna put them on and then I'll show you what it looks like. All right, boys, we got the spring out shock, the brake pad. These brakes are shot. So what did we do? We bought brand new ones. Brand new front and rear, all the rotors there. No ones in the trunk. Let's get these swapped out. Okay, boys, of course, something has to happen every time. O'Reilly's gave me the wrong parts. What's new? So back to O'Reilly's to pick up the right parts and then put them on. It's so freaking hot. Touching back on this video, I went to O'Reilly's, got the brakes, got everything done, put the coilovers on the car, got the top fixed on the convertible, and it's done. I'm gonna show it to you now. Check this thing out. Uh, I don't know if I showed you guys the wheels I got, but I did get the style fives. I don't have any caps for them. I gotta figure out the cap situation, but these things fit so clean. This is the fitment in the front. It's pretty conservative with the tire. It's really close to the fender, so I didn't want to scrub. The rear fitment, I had to go a little crazy to match. So we got essentially almost fender to lip, you know, the tire self-clearancing the bumper a little bit. It is what it is, you know? You gotta fucking make it work. Sorry for the bad words. But look how clean this thing is right now. Sitting so nice. It's like sitting perfectly level the way I wanted it to sit. Um, whole goal when building this car was, I wanted to drive something summertime when it's super hot like this. I need to get the AC recharged because the AC doesn't work too well. But look at this thing. <laughs> this thing is so sick. The downfall with this car is I wish it was a manual transmission. Unfortunately, it just came on across me so i had to buy it it was just a great freaking deal i bought it for four grand so four grand sixty nine thousand miles i drove it like this probably already a thousand miles um so i just hit 70k i wish it was manual but i mean it's cool because my girl can drive it she doesn't know how to drive stick shift one of my homies want to drive it they don't know how to drive stick it's uh, a little bit easier for everybody else and the amount of people that like when i'm driving with the top down like drive by me and they're like yo that thing's sick it's so crazy because you wouldn't think honestly that many people even like what like e36s 
but you'd be surprised, you know? I pull up to the gas station, fill up gas, and normally, like, every time I have somebody tell me something, like, dude, that thing is sick. And, you know, it's pretty hype when people actually like the shit that you do. It's hot as shit. Let's take this thing home. Look at this thing. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> so sick. This thing actually drives extremely nice. I have the AC on right now. It doesn't really work. I mean, when I'm driving, the air is cold. But when I'm, like, stand still, it doesn't. Oh, look at that thing. That thing is sick. But anyways, damn, a sick-ass pre-runner just mobbing over there. I wish I had my truck. I always see the cool trucks when I'm not driving my truck. But, dude, this thing drives super nice. I got to get rid of that brake light. I did the brakes already, but for some reason the light don't work. And the passenger uh, airbag light, I don't know why that's on either. I mean, I ain't got no problems with my airbags. But low-key, this thing is a freaking vibe. And we are home, boys. You know what's also sick about this? Check this out. Yeah. OEM BMW freaking alarm still works. That's so crazy. Uh, I love looking at this thing, low-key. I don't mind it with the top up. The top is actually in super good condition. Um, I washed it like pretty good the other day and it's actually very nice condition. The rear window though, this did crack from the heat, I'm assuming. So did this right here. So I'm gonna get a new window. I know that it's like a zip tied. No, not zip tied, sorry. It's like a zipper with glue. So that shouldn't be a problem. I could probably get that changed over one of the weekends. But Loki still looks pretty good with the top up. And had to get a set of fresh badges. But I'm gonna leave this thing here for the day. Good night, my love. I'll see you later. Ooh, low key, the best shoes ever. Literally, these were disgusting the other day and I threw them in the washing machine, and now they're brand new. But anyways, let's go get ready. We're gonna go to the fair and take the baby. Hopefully it's not too hot over there. It's closer towards the beach, so it won't be too bad. But let's get a little day, little day vlog in. Hey, why are you scared? <laughs> she's all excited for the ride, goes on five seconds and she's out. Hey! Ah! Hey, are you scared? <laughs> she looks like she went through a war right now. 